Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to do easy motion tracking in Adobe Premiere. Uh, this saves you time if you don't want to bring something over to After Effects and you just want to do like a real simple track uh, for something. You can use this technique in Adobe Premiere to save yourself time from having to go to the other program or if you don't have it, you can do this. Uh, first thing you want to do is go down to New Item, click that, and click Title. Click OK and we'll bring up the window. This is where we're going to start our track or where you're going to insert kind of what you want to track whether it's text or a circle or, or whatever. Usually I do like a circle and we'll show you what I do. And let's say we want to track something around this bracket right here. I draw my circle over that. You can hold down shift to keep it uh, correct aspect ratio. And then I, if you want to make an outline with nothing in the middle, do a stroke and for our purposes we'll just make it red and then go up to fill, uncheck that, so that way we just have a circle. Go ahead and position that over what you want to track, and then you're all set here, X this out, and now we have our new uh, title cover track with our circle, which is what we're gonna track. So you start your video where you want to begin your track, you, you place your time marker there, and then you go ahead and drop that title track on that you created. Now you'll have your circle right where you made it in um, the title window, and now we're gonna begin tracking it. Go ahead and click your title track layer and then go over to effect controls, drop down the motion information and this is where we're going to begin. Click the clock for position and now click on motion and this is going to let you move it around. So what you want to do is use spacebar to toggle start and stop, kind of double tap it and then every time the ch frames change a little bit then we're going to reposition our layer and so on and so forth till we are done with our track. So right now we can hit space, stop, and now we reposition our our layer, space, stop, reposition our layer, space, stop, reposition our layer again. And go on till the end of the clip. Now if you want to make it track longer then all you do is drag out the length of your title uh, track that we created a minute ago. If not, then once the title track runs out, then the track is just going to disappear. And that's where our track will end. So now, if we go back and watch, it's going to follow and calculate um, all the movements between the spots that we paused and move the frame. So it's just kind of an easy way to do a quick uh, tracking. You can do that with a picture and an object. It's pretty much the same. Uh, if it's a picture layer, you still do the motion and position thing just the same as we did here. This is just with like um, a circle if you want to like call something out or draw attention to it. Now if you wanted to go back to this title track and let's say add some text to that, like uh, you're highlighting what you're tracking, you can add uh, some words. You know. bracket and position that on your layer close it out now that it's updated it'll just add the text and follow right along bracket it's not perfect but it does go through in a, in a pinch and the more uh, accurate you are where you stop and reposition your frames the better tracked it's gonna be but it's just a quick way that you can do it in Adobe Premiere without having to go over to After Effects and then uh, render your whole clip out and all that. So this is just an easy way to do a little motion track uh, trick in Adobe Premiere. So it's just a little time saver and uh, thanks for watching guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope to help you uh, with your videos. If you liked, please give a thumbs up and check out my channel for a bunch of other Adobe Premiere tutorials.